this is April at Georgia Girl Plans. I have another B6 plan with me for you today, and I'm going to be using this kit. It is called Cozy from Nightingale Paper Co. And I um, picked up these sheets um, a la carte. So I picked up the full boxes, which I just love this little kitten and all the cozy winter vibes. Then I picked up the functional page with the date covers, icons, weekend banner, and checklist, and then all of the boxes. And I really like how she pulled in different colors. My last two weeks of winter kits have been really all like blue and white and I use silver foil. So I like how she pulled in the yellows and reds with this um, out of some of these boxes. So I decided to mix it up a little bit and pull in rose gold foil this week. So I'm gonna use this washi from Simply Gilded. It's like a pink plaid with rose gold. And then I'm gonna pull in rose gold uh, foiled date dots and some icons and boxes. So kinda wanted to mix it up a little bit and um, but keep with the winter vibes. Um, last week was kind of a bust for me. I was sick three days last week, so I wasn't posting a lot. I wasn't really planning a lot at all, just trying to get better. So I may sound a little bit congested still, but I feel much better. So really excited to get planning and just have a new fresh week. So this is starting the month of February in this insert. This insert is from City Girl Planners and um, so this was this past week and um, each month they have a new like month section. So moving into February, I'm not 100% sure, but this may be my last week in these inserts because my B6 rings has shipped from Print Pression. So I'm really excited about that. But there's either gonna be one or two weeks in these inserts, we shall see. I have really enjoyed them and have been making them work for me. But I'm really looking forward to moving into week on four pages. As always, or if this is the first time you're watching one of my B6 plans plan with me in these inserts, you can see the grid pattern behind this washi, but I just do not have the patience or the desire to use all the white out needed to cover up that grid pattern. So, and especially with this, with the plaid, I don't think it's too horrible. So I'm just going to put this washi right over that and it will be fine. So I um, have started picking up um, smaller kits and a la carte kits to use in um, these uh, inserts because I just don't need as much. So I didn't pick up the washi, washi page with these. So I am just pulling in the Simply Gilded washi and then I'm gonna pull in these I don't actually have any rose gold headers, which is something that I need to change. Um, these foiled headers from Bodacious Prints are my favorite. I've got them in a ton of different colors, but I realize I only have gold and silver. So I'm going to get some rose gold ones, but I am gonna use this color um, glitter headers. It is gold foil. I don't really mind mixing the two, and I kind of feel like this color makes it look rosy. So I don't think it'll be too bad. So I did put that Simply Gilded Washi down there. I'm going to white out this February 2019 because the date covers cover most of it. So let me see. This these date covers with the kit are a little bit light. Let me I'm gonna put one down and see if you can see. Oh no, I think it's okay. I was trying to see if I needed to white out um, the day and date on the insert but it looks like it will be fine. I thought about pulling in different date covers to have a little bit more color, but these are so pretty. I mean, it, they, these are all winter spreads, so I'm gonna have a lot of blue and white, and that's okay. But I did pull in rose gold date dots from Wild Summer Designs, so that'll bring a little bit of color up here. And then I did go ahead and cut down the checklist that come with the kit. For Monday through Friday, I'm using five checks and then four for Saturday and Sunday because I don't have as much room here, nor do I have as much going on. Um, Try to relax on those days. So I'm just gonna use glitter headers. I'm not gonna use any um, 
words over these headers. The past few weeks I've pulled in uh, to do or remember headers. So for the foiled glitter headers, I don't really like putting anything over them. I think they're so pretty on their own. And I know that these are to-do lists. I don't really need headers telling me that they're to-do lists. <laughs> so. This past um, Friday was really exciting because there was a ton of new releases and sales. So I picked up a lot of stuff. So I will have a haul video coming soon. Okay, so as you can see, this spread is almost completely done and you didn't get to see any of it. I um, use my phone for recording currently. My husband and I are researching um, getting a nice camera for my recording and pictures and I have run into this problem before where I'm recording and someone calls and it stops my recording without me realizing because I'm down here laying down stickers and not looking. So I started putting on my phone on Do Not Disturb, thinking that would help. Well, guess what? It does not. Someone called. The phone stopped recording. I continued laying down stickers. My husband told me to try airplane mode, so that is what I'm doing now. But needless to say, it does not help that I just laid down all these stickers and you did not get to see any of it. So I'm gonna go through and show you what I did, finish up the last few things I have to do. So, sorry about that. I love how this is turning out. Um, and yeah, so um, the last thing it looks like you saw was me putting down the glitter header on Friday. So I went through and put down my checklist um, Monday through Sunday. I didn't put glitter headers on Saturday and Sunday just to give me a little bit more room to work with. Um, I did use the glitter headers from Bodacious Prints that are in gold foil. Um, I am doing rose gold in this spread, but I don't have any rose gold headers, so I think I did discuss that. But anyways, I um, went through and put down full boxes on the two days that I have meetings, and then I have meeting scripts I'm going to put over those from Nightingale Paper Co. And then on the days that I don't have um, out of town meetings, I put down quarter boxes or labels, and I put down my film edit upload um, icons. These are from Rose Colored Days, so I put those down on the um, days I don't have meetings to um, just mark, you know, what I needed to accomplish that day for my YouTube schedule. I did put down a quarter box down here for my cousin's birthday and use the icon from the kit. I did pull some scripts from the kit this to clean and then this plan um, just to mark the things that um, this is my to clean list and um, Saturday I do my planning put this laptop from the kit on Tuesday to mark um, some proposals I have to send out these meeting scripts are from Nightingale Paper Co. I love them I am ordering some more because I am running low um, so on Wednesday, I'm having lunch with a friend, so I need to put an icon down for that. I think I'm gonna put this heart. And I didn't have a second thing to do on Tuesday, so I put down one of these pretty um, bow dividers from Bodacious Prints in rose gold. Also put two of those down here just to have a little something else going on with this washi. And I put one over the full box over here. I chose to use these full boxes, one, because Monday you always need coffee, I love this cat, and then I wanted to pull in some more of that red um, with this full box. So, last thing I am going to do, I just thought of and now it has escaped me, oh, I'm having lunch with a different friend on Friday, so I was going to put that car right there for that lunch. And then this will be my happy mail I'll fill out. I'll fill out my cleaning list and then my habit trackers down here. So I really like how this looks. I'm going to show you everything I have left in the kit. I do use these kits in my dailies and health inserts as well. So I've got these four full boxes as well as these headers, which I will definitely use. Some more um, half boxes, quarter boxes, and then the functional items, which I'll probably save. And then the weekend banner I use in my health inserts, and then I've got some more icons. So, 
for this basic plan with me. It is going to be very short because I lost a lot of the footage. So I don't want to bore you by just filling in everything. Um, I'm sorry this video is kind of a fail. Kind of just goes with how my week was last week, but it's okay. I'm gonna turn it all around and it's gonna be great. So if you'd like to see um, pictures up close of this spread, um, you can follow me on Instagram. I'm at Georgia Girl Plans. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I do upload two times a week. So if you're not already, please subscribe to my channel. Comment below and let me know what you think and I will see you guys next time. Bye.